Good morning guys, welcome to today's video. Today's video is sponsored by all our puppies, all of our little okay, dogs. Okay, hurry up. Oh, oh, she's she's eating your ears. Yeah, she, 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 kiss, that basting. she kisses your ears and then she bites them. Oh, she ate a horse pizza Hurry today. up. Today's video is sponsored by our dogs. It's pouring rain outside. We are gonna be going down to the bar to check on Storm. But for now, we are gonna share some of the things that we do with our dogs on a regular basis. Okay, right. so what's this called? Right there, the disappearing trick. So, first of all, we're gonna try gonna make her look at me. the disappearing trick. Okay, be quiet. Molly! 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 Hey! 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 Molly! <laughs> she knew where you were! Hi! Molly! 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 So basically, you just cut off the tip where I it's know. really rough. And Not where it's red. Right, because that's blood, and we don't want to we don't want to trim her till she hurts, and we want to make it a really pleasurable experience for her because we want her to like it. Where where are those treats? <laughs> it's Sophie? so soft, it just comes off. So yeah, because it's all red. That yeah, yeah. So she just has tawny nails. They're just getting a little bit sharp. Here, give me a treat. Oh, it's such a Wait good girl. One. I feel like I feel like a part of the reason that puppies don't wait, here. And I just said wait. No, she needs them while she's getting it done so that she associates it with a good girl. Hey, where's her dew claw? Does she have dew claws? Yes. Oh, that's a pain. Okay, go ahead. She should do one now and then get a treat. Ah! But. Ah, but. Wait, I'm not. Wait, give me a treat for her. Here, I'll hold it here for her to try and chew. And then she'll. Oh, goodness. Don't eat the whole thing. So, for puppies, it's annoying because they're little and they don't want to lay still for so long. They just want to get running. And for other dogs, it I feel like it's the pressure of, like, holding the little... Oh, you little sneaker. I need bigger treats that she can't get a hold of. So, 
the goal is to make sure that we don't get any of the quick so she never has a bad experience. Um, is this your first time ever cutting dog's nails? No. I think it is. Let's cut Macy's and Ruby's. Uh, here you go. Noon and Gabby and I are ready to go down to the barn and uh, do some stuff for the horses. But before we go, I want to ask you guys a really important question. The question is, would would you rather your your pet be so comfortable and happy, or would you rather them look good? If you could choose, would you rather them look good, or would you rather them be comfortable and happy? The reason that I ask this is because I know we're going to get a lot of judgments on the fact that Ruby has not been to the groomer in a long time. You guys know she's been looking ragged and it has come to a time when I can't even stand to look at her anymore. She's so matted. She's so covered in yuck. She is like a month past her grooming time. One thing about me, I am not a good groomer. I do not have the experience, the skill, the patience to groom a dog. So, I asked Sophie to do it. And Sam, <laughs> I blamed it on them. You did it mostly. So just, just keep in mind that the new Ruby might not be as beautiful as the old Ruby, but that's okay because she's gonna be comfortable. And please, don't send me emails saying that you were gagging while you watched the video of her being groomed and that I've done it all completely wrong. I promise, I know that I'm not experienced at this. This is why we've been in the house all day, it is wet, and rainy and I think this is the last day it might be tomorrow actually I think it's supposed to rain again tomorrow but then the weekend is gonna be glorious we have we're gonna be able to do so much this weekend I'm excited now we are gonna give our horses lunch and we're gonna check on storm Gabby's been cold hosing his leg he has not had any more heat thank you for all your well wishes Oh, hello, handsomes. Wow, you guys have been pooping in there. For a second, I thought you were Whoa, oh my God. That's why you can't leave anything with horses? Dangerous, better check them now. Do not come at me. Right, we are ready to do it. So it's been almost 48 hours. That Storm has been in his stall. Stall Yeah. And he's not going crazy. That's the thing. I feel like... He just gets very energetic. Yeah, well, that's the thing, though. I feel like, you know, when you go to the hospital and you don't really need to be in the hospital, you're like, moving around, let's get out of here. But then when you break your pelvis in seven spots and you need to be in the hospital and you just lay there and don't move, yeah, that's how you know you need to be in the hospital. And that's how you know no, you need to be in stall rest. Talk, moving around too much. And then it's just like, oh, excuse you. The nurse never told me that. Well, the nurse will tell you that. If you're moving around too much. Let me feel his foot when he comes out.
Is it better? Gabby says it's a little better, so maybe a couple more days. I don't know. Send that video to our trainer. Don't play with them. I'll send, I will send that video to our trainer and she'll tell me what to do next. And if she needs to send it to our vet, then she will do that too. Uh, I don't know, we'll see. Okay, are you guys ready to see? That's how I find her in the morning. See the final installment of Ruby 2.0? It's a glow up, you guys, compared it's to not. what It's not, it's a glow down. It's a glow down. Keep in mind, we don't know how to do it, but we are invested in making her happy in the time that we can't take her to be groomed. That's what I wake it's up to. It's a necessity. Too. Molly, sit. Good girl. That's what I wake up to. Look at that. The eyes. Okay, dun da 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 Oh my gosh, she is so skinny. She is so skinny. She's a little ragged. We do not abuse our animals. She's a little ragged, a little. She's gonna have a bath, but I bet you she feels a lot better. Yeah, that looks horrible. No, it feels so oh much God, better. A little rusty. Pouring rainy day, lame horses. A day you definitely don't want to go outside. It makes you get inventive. So today, Sophie was like, I want chips, can you buy me chips? And I'm like, no, we're not eating any more processed crap. Although we did still eat a little bit of processed crap, but we decided to make our own chips. So we made our own chips. So these are ketchup chips. So what we ended up doing was we made potatoes, like we cut up potatoes and made chips, and we got ketchup flavor. And dill pickle. And dill pickle flavor, and we made some. These are them, these are the chips we made. Here's the taste test. This way, all right, taste test. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, these are our homemade chips. Flip that one around so Okay. Can I get them? You can come over here. Okay, Sam. Sam's editing the vlog, but we want oh, you to be what is that? ketchup. I'm ketchup. gonna make. I'm gonna try a small one. You don't have any faith in us. Really good, huh? Way yeah. better than store-bought ones. Has more flavor. Okay, I'm gonna take Gabby. Okay, Gabby, try our homemade chips. You want you can take like they that. match your hair. Take a big one or take whatever one you like. Lots of spice. She doesn't trust it. Well, I don't like um, ketchup. Ketchup. This one oh, works. do you like dill pickle? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll make dill pickle or just plain salt. I like both. Okay, try it. Good. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm like you know when Gabby agrees that they're good, that they are good. I hope you guys are finding lots of time to do cooking yeah. together as a family and finding new recipes and doing things to bond while we're stuck inside. Sea salt flavor, ketchup flavor, and I'm bringing out some dill pickle ones. Which one do you like? Which ones do you like better so far? I don't know. I love the ketchup. I never knew I loved ketchup so much. I love them both. Gabby's gonna do a taste test and tell us her favorite brand. Ketchup, sea salt, or dill pickle? With sea salt. Oh, oh boy. Dill pickle. Sophie and I like them all. Pickle. You like the dill pickle? I didn't make as many dill pickle because I didn't think anybody would like them. That is too much. Too, too salty. My favorite were the ketchup, obviously, because those are the ones you that. Eat them all. No, I divided them. That looks them. like a banana. So, I like the ketchup. She likes the dill pickle. You like the. Oh. You like all of them. Yeah.